this is Phil Hardy again with another show, uh, second show of 2013. I'd like to kick off the show with a track that was from an album that was never actually released. Uh, it was called Whispers and Lies by myself and Katie Butler. Uh, Katie's a multi-instrumentalist and musical arranger. Um, she also sings. Uh, here's a track from the album. It's called The Blacksmith. <laughs> how much work goes into a track like that. Uh, Katie did all the background vocals and played the flute 
and I did the rest and we both mixed it. Uh, moving on, um, another thing that I did with uh, a guy called Damon Mullane, um, one of the hardest pieces of whistle playing I've ever had to do in my life. Just keeping up with the guy's speed was uh, mind-blowing. Uh, this is the Moving Cloud set from uh, my album uh, Highs and Lows. <laughs> Thank you. 
I love all this one take stuff. It just kind of works. It has the energy that you need for a really good knees up track. Uh, moving on, uh, getting away from knees up tracks. Um, I was given the album um, last year, at the end of last year, by John McSherry, The Olam. Um, I'm really into this kind of progressive new look at uh, playing these instruments, low whistles and stuff. Um, here's a track from the Olam's album, uh, Bridge of Glass. Uh, really like it. It's just got a, a refreshing vibe to it. I suggest you get yourself a coffee. A coffee? Well, you could get yourself a coffee, but you could get yourself a coffee and have a coffee. So I hope you enjoy it. <laughs> Thank you. 
yes, another abrupt end in there from the Olam. Uh, John told me last year that uh, the actual band, plus a few extra members, are going to be extensively touring the USA this year. So uh, you want to get on their website. That's Olam with uh, three L's, O-L-L-L-A-M. Um, check them out and uh, go and support them. Uh, it's a fresh and new approach to playing Celtic music. Uh, moving on now... Um, I like to try and get a bit of Philippe Barnes into most shows because he has a particular style. Um, he's a great flutist and uh, he's also now playing guitar with Cross Harbour, which are another great band fronted by Sam Proctor on fiddle and uh, Orla McAuliffe on uh, low whistles and flute. Um, incredibly uh, talented group of people. Not sure who the Bowron player is, but check them out. I'm sure there's uh, plenty on the internet, especially YouTube. I've seen some videos on YouTube, so uh, Cross Harbour. Um, this is a track from a, a Kaylee party album called Thingamajig, which uh, was put out by Gremlin Music many years ago. And um, it's a track that features uh, Philippe. It's called uh, Tommy Betty's Waltz. Hope you enjoy it. is there with thingamajig great album if you can get a copy so sliding further down the slope into folk oblivion we hit the album sylvan baru uh, it was recorded last year by sylvan baru it features many artists including donald lunny uh, this is the uh, first track on the album the naga jigs 
I think it's great. finally ascended to the lofty heights of folk elite the uh, guy is unbelievable um he's one of these guys that seems to allow 
the ancient traditions of the folk music to blend beautifully with fresh ideas. And I think that's where folk music in a way is going these days. It's a, a blending of different forms of music, but not letting go of the uh, original formats. I love it. Um, moving on, um, we're going to blend a very old idea, which is Chief Wanganui, Aka Tony Hinnigan. Um, I'm plugging his album because he needs the money. Uh, it's Atacama. This is a track um, called Ascender. The album was based on the idea of the Chilean miners' crisis. Um, so this is the Ascender. This is bringing them up, I suppose. <laughs> Thank you. 
Ascender there by Incantation featuring Tony Hinnigan and Mike Taylor. Uh, engineered by Spider. Done a great job, guys. Um, hope it's doing well. And on another note, uh, we're going back to uh, an album called uh, Carrying a Tune or Carrying the Tune by Kevin Crawford. I played a track from it on the last show. Um, it's a fantastic album, so I just have to kind of keep plugging it and saying get a copy because it's it's just raw delight. That's what I would have called it, but what do I know? This is a track from Kevin, Taylor's Fancy, Tanglawny, and Willie Clancy's. <laughs> accompanied by John Doyle, the amazing left-handed strummer. He also writes some good tunes too, and songs. Anyway, moving on, um, I used to play many years ago, back in the 80s, in a duo on guitar, and it was called Wing and a Prayer. Uh, that band or duo format has been around pretty much for 30-odd years now. Uh, I was the original guitarist, and uh, I used to work with the singer, Pete Curtis, uh, Pete Curtis, uh, as far as I know, is still working with Wing and a Prayer on and off as a duo. And we used to just do covers around the pubs and it was really good fun and um, had a lot of good times. So this is just in memory of me and Pete from back in the 80s. This is Fast Car. Mm-hmm. 
you got a fast car I wanna take it to anywhere Maybe we'll make a deal Maybe together we can get somewhere Any place is better Start from zero, got nothing to lose Maybe we'll make something Me, myself, I got nothing to prove You got a fast car I got a plan to get us out of here Working at the convenience store I managed to save just a little bit of money Won't have to drive too far Just across the border and into the city You and I can both get jobs And finally see what it means to be living Living See, my old man's got a problem He lives with the bottle, that's the way it is Says his body too old for working His body's too young to look like his Mama went off and left him She wanted more from life than he could give I said somebody got to take care of him So I quit school and that's what I did You got a fast car Is it fast enough so we can fly away? We gotta make a decision Gotta leave tonight or live and die this way So remember when we were driving Driving in your car Speed so fast I felt like I was drunk City lights lay out before us And your arm felt nice around around my shoulder And I I had a feeling like I belong I, 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 I had a feeling I could be someone Be someone You got a fast car We go cruise and entertain ourselves You still ain't got a job Now I work in the market as a checkout girl I know things will get better You'll find work and I'll get promoted We'll move out of this shelter We'll buy a big house live in the suburbs So remember when we were driving Driving in your car Speed so fast I felt like I was drunk City lights lay out before us on your arm belt Nice wrap around my shoulder And I, 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 I had a feeling like I belong I, 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 I had a feeling like I'd be someone Be someone, be someone You got a fast car I got a job that pays all our bills You stay out drinking late at the bars You see more of your friends than you do your kids I'd always hope for better Thought maybe together you and me'd find it Got no plans, go nowhere Take a fast car, keep on driving Keep on driving So remember when we were driving Driving in your car, speed so fast I felt like I was drunk City lights lay out before us And your arm felt nice wrapped round my shoulder And I, 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 I had a feeling like I belonged I, 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 I had a feeling I could be someone, be someone You got a fast car Is it fast enough so you can fly away? You gotta make a decision you Gotta leave tonight Live and die this way Yes, recorded live in a bedroom on a 8-track Fostex quarter-inch machine and then about 15 years later a bit of percussion and bass was added uh, it was all recorded just for fun but it's nice to look back and remember those days 
Uh, looking back to about two years ago, uh, John McSherry released an album called Soma. Um, I didn't really get a copy at the time because uh, John's extensive schedule of touring meant that he could never send me a copy. Well, I finally got a copy about a year and a half after it was released. And I'm going to, to take another track from it. This is The Slides from Grace, or The Slide from Grace even. <laughs> Thank you. 
seems to have the uh, fire of Celtic blood running through his veins. He's an amazing player and uh, never ceases to amaze me. Grab a copy if you can and anything else that he's ever played on, including the Cool Finn album, which has some fantastic playing of his on it. Moving on, uh, I played a track earlier from the Katie Butler album, Whisper and Lies, which we did together. Uh, I'm going to indulge myself and play another track, which I really enjoyed putting together. Katie came to me with an idea uh, that she'd uh, got this old tune called The Creel, but she'd heard some music played on one of uh, the folk albums that were really current at the time, which was... uh, I believe, a fluke album. So we sort of looped up and uh, worked on um, some of the vibe from that album and put the Creole lyric over the top of it. And it seemed to work. So uh, the Creole, Katie Butler, Whispers and Lies. As I roved out on a moonlit night, excitement far to find I met on the way with a pretty little girl and I asked her to be mine With me to Raya, for a riddle, me to Raya, right for a riddle to Nio How can I get to your father's house, how can I get to your bed? Oh, my father locks the door at night and the keys lie under his head With me to Raya, for a riddle, me to Raya If you get a lad of thirty foot, thirty foot and three, and place it up to the chimney pot, come down in the creel to me with me to Raya, for a riddle, me to Raya, right for a riddle to Nio. But the old one, she was still awake, heard something that was said. I lay the life, said the silly old wife, there's a man in your daughter's bed with me to Raya. talking about earlier on about mixing it up this is a really old song given a bit of a new flavor and uh, 
I'll play some more from the uh, album on future shows. I know it's been a bit self-indulgent, this show, but I'm feeling a bit self-indulgent because I lost my dog a couple of weeks ago and uh, it's been a bit of a sad time, I suppose. You know, you lose your dog, special feelings, and a big gap left. And it's kind of hard to know whether to get another dog. You know, it's kind of strange one that I'm kind of working that one out so I'm feeling a bit sort of introspective at the moment so it's interesting to play some stuff that has an introspection a thing that makes me feel introspective is quaila music it's a, it's like reggae it's a standalone kind of thing that only travels very very few miles from South Africa um it has a gr- a gravitas to it that I don't see with many pieces of music. And I just love the vibe of the way they play the whistles. It's totally unique and it's a great pleasure to be able to play a whistle in somewhere near the style that these guys... So this is a track dedicated to the South African quailer players. It's called Humongous Clunt. Jamie Murray on kit and beats and Dave Adams on keyboards that wouldn't have been possible without them it's an amazing track Uh, it's amazing how tracks come together because that was recorded with the drum track first there was no tune no nothing I just pointed the mics at the kit and I said there's tempo give me something along the lines of x y and z and he just played off the top of his head and got inspired 
and then me and Dave just filled the track up behind it. Unbelievable way to make music, but uh, very interesting and very uncomplicated. Well, we're coming to the end of the show now. Um, no show really would be complete without me, I'll make Mike. So here's a track of his Aurora album. I hope you enjoy it. <laughs> game uh, i'd like to wish mike all the best and um i hope he's enjoying all the success that he seems to uh deserve so fair play man well that's the end of the show i hope you enjoyed it i'd just like to say something if you're into progressive things to check out uh, www 
hardyadams.com. You can see some of the stuff that I've been doing with Dave. Uh, we've been writing music for a multimedia concept. So if you uh, enjoy what I'm doing, check out uh, hardyadams.com and I'll see you next time. Mm-hmm.